put this out there. Why to document my daily business journey, I guess. But uh, I got a couple of sick babies. I got one of them who's sleeping. And that's the one-year-old. Our newborn is uh, okay. <laughs> right before this video, she just threw up on my shoulder. But it is what it is. Sick babies and all. Just going to document part of the journey. And this is one of my favorite business practices that I wanted to share. And why it's one of my favorites. So I just got off the phone with, um, with a company that's hired me for... DJ and this company offers a lot of services themselves and and so they offered it wasn't my idea even though I'm open to this idea but they offered hey would you do cash payment plus uh, maybe take advantage of some of our some of our services now me and the, the the thing one of my best favorite business practices that I'm going to cover today is bartering the thing is I love bartering doesn't always have to be cash, but for me, very important, it has to be, it has to benefit my family. So if you're going to barter and you're going to give me stuff that doesn't benefit my children or my wife, then I'm good, man. It's all, I'll just take the straight cash. But this company offered me, and this company is the um, Gunstock Ranch here in our community. They said, would you take cash and then uh, we could do pony and horse rides for your children? And I'm like, all right, I'll take that because... You can make cash all day long, but then you're when you're benefiting my family, when they get to ride the horses, hey, what's up? How you doing, Jared or Crystal? When you're benefiting my family and they get to ride the ponies or the horses, then that's, to me, that's like even worth more than the cash. And so another um, example of this that I have done for two different hotels, both the Marriott and the Turtle Bay Resort here in our community, is um, I'll do straight Straight barter, no cash at all. Well, sorry, let me take that back. Some of them are cash payments for my services. Some of them straight barter. And uh, those are the times when we have staycations in the hotels, both in, again, both in the La Ia Marriott over here in the North Shore and also Turtle Bay Resort. And those are just making memories. And I don't know if you could put a cash dollar amount on this. So one of my favorite practices is bartering. So if you are into some kind of service or any kind of business or even a hobby that you really love and you'd like to barter, put it out there. You never know. I mean, that's what we did before we had the uh, the um, official cash put up. Oh, man, she's sleeping. Oh, no, she's up. Her eyes are open. Can you see the little surprise she left on my shoulder? Man, I was getting all ready for this video and then blah, she left me a surprise on my shoulder. I wish I could barter that away. The throwing up part, not her. Okay, so another thing that I did was the uh, the hotels, and I also got an offer for I was I'm doing some marketing for an auto body shop, Five Star Auto Solutions. They do painting, auto body, uh, mechanical. They also do uh, detailing. Anyways, a customer, customer that I know very well said, "Hey, uh, I'll barter. I, I'm into the alarm company uh, business or industry." Um, I'll put up some cameras, DVR, alarm monitors, and motion detectors if they fix my car. So I'm, I have to be there for the negotiation. So I told them, I will meet you there when I can. I can't this week. Kids are sick. I'm at home. And then we can hash it out. But bartering works. So that's my tip for the day. If you can barter, and if it makes sense to both parties, you and the whoever you're doing business with, then do it. It's not always about cash. And for me... I, I know I said this before, but if you're helping me make memories with my family, it's worth more than cash. All right. Hope this helps somebody out there. Hope you can do something to barter with somebody. Some legal services. Legit. Man, she's, she's getting really... She's about to cry, so I'm going to go right now. I apologize. No, actually, I don't apologize. I think I'm going to have more of my children in these lives because this is real life. Too bad I didn't catch her throwing up on me. That would have been real, real life. We need some more authenticity. We need when I fob out or stutter or spit on the on the camera on accident. I want to have my family in here. This is real life. You can still do business and still have a real life, right? She's like, take me inside. All right, have a blessed day. Stay blessed. Aloha.